we going? Santa. Santa? Santa. We're just here to get Give me a Christmas tree time and Santa and Mrs. Claus are both here. Let's do this. Go see Santa, Anna. Santa, <laughs> Anna. Come on up there. Oh, oh. Anna. I'll help you. There you go. You come over here. And then we can get your brother right in the middle. <laughs> How are you? Merry Christmas. Say Merry Christmas. Santa. Ready? Holly, turn around. Stay okay, back, Holly. I'm just gonna come back here, okay? Cutting our tree up. I turned the heater on. Yeah, it's cold, so man. Chill <laughs> down. <laughs> it did. Yeah. The sun went away. It's our quirky tree. It's getting there. Put the lights up, and I have to go get some hooks. I, I'm sure I have like, I know I have a ton. I just don't know where I put them. So this is a Christmas moving f special, 2016. We have stuff well, for move, getting ready for moving. Yeah. Kind of organized everything. Do you want me to, do you want yeah, me go to ahead. Them? I have to run to the store. <laughs> Bye. Hi guys. So. As you know, we're in the process of moving and and we're decorating our Christmas tree, but Jake showed you. Hi, hi, hi. Yeah. Hi, hi, hi. So I organized everything inside here. I also labeled, so keepsakes and mementos, baby clothes, cloth diapers, clothes for when I'm skinnier. Who knows when that will happen. And, um, more kids clothes there's maternity just in case who knows if God wants us to give us another baby I just didn't feel like I knew was to part with them yet so I don't know um, and then a bunch of pictures on the bottom and um, I transferred I had this box for years and I transferred all of my baptism like actually my baptismal gown Anna and Mary wore and and then Paul's baptismal outfit so I put all of that in there and I still even have my baptismal candle which is crazy um, anyhow um, yeah what else was I gonna say oh I went through like six boxes of six boxes of cards six or seven and some of them were really big boxes like a box this large like maybe two of them were about that size and the rest were maybe like around this size like large medium and a couple of small boxes but man just cards and cards and mementos and so i basically condensed all of it into this box right here um which feels really good because, man, I had so much stuff and they were all great and it was hard. It was actually emotional going through cards and cards. A lot of them were from my mom. Cards that my mom had kept from me from like when she had um, like baby gifts when I was born and stuff. And so I kept some treasures, but I didn't keep everything. I just said, you know what? I'm going to keep a few, but I'm not going to... To keep all of that, I just, this is my thought process. It's sitting in these boxes. And what am I, years and years have gone by and days and hours and seconds go by and I don't even think about it. And then I somehow, you know, I mean, it was nice going through everything, but 
it's not really benefiting me. It's just collecting dust and sitting in the garage. So, um, and I could make some sort of crafty, be crafty and don't get me wrong. I like to be crafty, but I just thought, eh, I'd rather be crafty with the photos. I really need to put all those in albums and I'm going to be simple, but I just want to organize them and put them all in albums so that they're not in this bin right there. That whole bottom bin is like filled with photos. So anyhow, so this move is, is exciting. I'm purging through so much stuff and making it organized. And I like the fact that these are all in plastic bins. So those stay there in the plastic bins. And boxes are just hard sometimes because you don't see what's inside and you kind of see what you wrote and I don't know. I just think it's better in a bin because you can look at it and then I also labeled it. So anyhow, this will be, um, this will be exciting to organize and make everything. And the other thing I was going to say, I know I'm talking a lot like I always do, but, um, the other thing I was going to say is we were thinking about getting my stepmom, Mary, she was going to give us her artificial tree. She had a little small, art, small artificial tree. And I thought, yeah, that'll be easier because we're moving. But and then I thought, well, we're not actually we're closing on December 8th, 28th. But we're not actually moving until the 6th, 7th and 8th of January. So. And who knows, we may get a blizzard and we can't move until a little bit later. And our landlord is cool. He said we can prorate all that jazz. So um, anyhow, that's the plan for us to move the 6th, 7th, and 8th. And we're supposed to get floors put in um, the living room, the basement, and the stairs. I think we're going to go with bamboo. We might go with oak, but I think we are stuck on bamboo. And anyhow... I just want um, to enjoy Christmas and not feel like, I'm like, we don't need to, we could just get a tree because after Christmas, like New Year's, we can take it down and put it all in the boxes. And that's gonna be right around the time we're packing. I mean, we're packing now um, or going through stuff, but I'm like, we don't need, to, it'd be one thing if we were moving on December 28th, then we may not even have gotten a tree. <laughs> but this, I'm like, yeah, we don't, we can get a tree. So no need to not be festive just because we're moving. So um, the timing will work out. And so we got a gorgeous tree. Um, isn't it so pretty, Mary? It's a balsam fir and it's just beautiful. Yeah, and daddy strung all the lights he did a really good job he even strung on the inside my mom would have approved she was like super OCD when it came to lighting a tree and sometimes she would like take the she'd look at it and go oh no and she'd take all the lights down and restring it and sometimes she'd do that like two times or even three and putting lights on a tree is probably my least favorite so Jake did a great job and anyway, I'm excited. Christmas. Yeah. Oh, and then this is our chain for our Advent. Every night we have a family time for Advent, and we've been coloring and adding a piece of to ring to the chain. There it is. All its glory. The new tree. Put some lights up on the mm -hmm. stairs. We got our mini tree. Thanks, honey. You're welcome. Looks good. That was... But, yeah, we decided to decorate, even though we're going to be moving and packing. Not moving, but packing in the meantime. But, yeah, it's nice to have... Kitty agrees. Right, Kitty? Yeah. So everything looks good. Kids are excited about the decorations. Got some snow last night. Kind of melting now though, but it was, uh, it was a good amount. A couple inches. Let's go back from church. Yeah, very pretty morning. Roads are a little slushy, but not too bad. But we got everything decorated. I showed you last night, but this is daytime view. Look how pretty our tree is. Super nice. I showed you guys last night. But it's really nice. We'll have some tacky Christmas. I like it. 
That looks pretty. Mommy. It's a little gaudy. Mommy. <laughs> That's a nice banister. That's the. Uh, we had these lights, and I'm like, I'll just put them on the banister. It's the banister of joy. Festive. St. Nicholas Day tomorrow, so we put some goodies in the kids' shoes. They left their shoes out. Some chocolate coins, a Christmas book, and some pajamas. So they'll be excited when they wake up. I think St. Nicholas was here. St. Nicholas was here. Oh! What did he bring you guys? Wow! What did he get you? Snoopy! He got you Snoopy jammies and chocolate coins. We got you. We got you a book too. Oh, oh. what these Snoopy Daddy? Those are your shoes. He just puts presents in your shoes. <laughs> Snoopy Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Snoopy Daddy. Wow! That is cool.